An antibody has two main parts which are involved in its functions. They are, fragment antigen binding, or fab fragment, and fragment crystallizable region, that is, FC region. The fab fragment is involved in recognizing and binding antigens. Whereas, the FC region binds to different immune cell receptors, and evokes different effector functions, that result in the destruction and removal of the antigens. The first function is, opsonization. Antibody opsonization is a process in which, an antibody binds to a pathogen, thereby marking it for phagocytosis. Hey phagocyte! Here is a pathogen recognized. Please destroy him. Sure. Mission completed. The second function is, neutralization. Pathogens such as viruses enter their target cells by binding to specific receptors. Neutralizing antibodies can bind to the surface of these pathogens, and block their entry into the cell. This process is called, antibody neutralization. Attack! Attack! Stop! We, we will not, not allow, allow you to, to infect, infect our, body. our body. The third function is, complement activation. The complement system contains a collection of plasma proteins, that work together to fight infection. In a classical complement pathway, a complement protein detects antibodies bound to the surface of a pathogen. This activity further activates other complement proteins, resulting in the formation of the membrane attack complex, a cylindrical structure, that is inserted into the cell wall of the pathogen, thus puncturing its membrane. Through this pore, fluids and molecules flow in and out of the cell. Ultimately, the cell swells, and bursts. Hey Compliment, we, we have, have found, found a pathogen. pathogen. Please, Please kill, kill him. him. Okay, I will activate the Compliment pathway. Hey guys, antibodies have detected a pathogen. Let us kill him. Command received. Let, Let us poke, poke him so that, that he will, will burst and die. die. The fourth function is, immune complex formation. The binding of multiple antigens and antibodies together can form immune complexes. Complex formation limits the antigen's diffusing ability, making it easier for phagocytosis, and allows simultaneous destruction of several pathogens. Come let us attack the body. There are very few antibodies to defend. Hey friends, don't worry. We are sufficient to protect our body. Come, let us cross-link them so that, they cannot move. Hey Phagocyte! You have got a feast today! Whoa! Enjoy! That was yummy! And the last function is, antibody-dependent cell-mediated cytotoxicity. Antibodies bind and opsonize target cells such as, virus-infected host cells, or, tumor cells. Effector cells such as natural killer cells recognize the FC portion of the antibody and get activated. The activated natural killer cells release cytotoxic granules such as perforin and granzymes into the target cell, which triggers apoptosis, that is programmed cell death of the target cell. Hey natural killer cell! I have detected a virus infected cell. And I have detected a tumor cell. Please, Please deal, deal with, with these, these target, target cells. cells. Don't worry. I will destroy these target cells so that, they will not affect the neighboring healthy cells. Mission completed.